<laughs> I honestly love filming videos right here. It's just super fun, super chill, super relaxing. I literally don't have to do anything. I just put my camera on my blanket bin and I just film. So it's super easy. So today you have noticed I have a bunch of t-shirts right here. I wear t-shirts so much. These are the only things I basically wear. Like graphic tees are literally like majority of my closet probably I would say like 50% of it is graphic tees and then like 50% of it is sweaters <laughs> so we're gonna do a graphic tee collection I'll tell you guys where I get my graphic tees how I get them and all of that fun stuff so I'm keeping them on the hanger because I'm not gonna take off all these things even though I'm gonna film like a try on portion so I technically do have to take off the hanger I don't feel like doing that right now so when I every time I go to a new place I like to grab a big T I normally get all my T's in 2XL because that fits perfect for my body perfect oversize sometimes I get an extra large in case the 2XL is too big or if I want it to fit more fitter um, but normally it's 2XL is my size um, so I usually get T's everywhere I go like I said so I went to the Outer Banks um, last fall so I grabbed this tee this is also like only eight dollars so to get really really nice graphic tees when you travel get a t-shirt and that way also you have like you remember something right? like you remember going to that city so San Francisco I have a couple San Francisco tees honestly I wish I got bigger size in them because they don't really I like my tees super big and these just fit if I want it to be like a slimmer fit. But I have this San Francisco one. We have this Breckenridge one. This one is so soft and so comfy. I seriously love this t-shirt so much. And I love the color of it. I love this Breckenridge one. This is another San Francisco one, and I absolutely love this t-shirt so much, but it doesn't fit me. I probably should get rid of it. It's, I wonder if there's, like, something I can do, like, crop it or, like, do something with it, because I love this t-shirt so much. If you guys know me, I love San Francisco. It is my favorite city in the entire world. Seriously love that place so much. So, another place I get t-shirts is Target in the men's section. Their graphic tees are literally the best. Every time I go to Target, I sweep by there and see if there's a t-shirt that's new that I want. They have tons and tons and tons of different graphic tees there. Different shows, um, like places. They just have like so much, like movies. They just have so much in the men's section. And I like men's clothing because it's bigger on me and... I don't know how many times I want to say this in this video. I like big t-shirts. <laughs> so I can go to the men's section. I usually don't buy women's t-shirts. It's just what happens. I don't know. It's just what happens. So I got this one about two years ago. So it says pretty damn good babysitter Steve Harrington. If you guys know me, I absolutely love Stranger Things. It is probably one of my favorite shows. Season 3 was so good. I literally cried my eyes out. Oh my gosh, Season 3 came out like a year ago. I wonder when Season 4 is coming out. So this is another Stranger Things tea. This is actually the Season 3 one. The Steve Harrington one that I just showed you guys was from Season 2. I don't have a Season 1 t-shirt, unfortunately. <laughs> but this is Season 3. I love this because I love this L. Like, I love Season 3 L so much. She is so cute, so sweet. And I just really like this one. Again, got that one at Target. This is the only one I didn't get at Target and that they do have a NASA tee at Target. It just isn't blue. I think it's black and then it has the NASA logo that's blue. Um, I got this in Walmart. Um, the same quality, nothing different. I just happened to find that at Walmart and wanted to get it. So this one I recently just bought and I love it because I just got a Nintendo Switch about a couple months ago and I play it every day. Love that boy so much. So I thought this was kind of funny because I have a Nintendo Switch and I just thought it was just part of my gamer girl aesthetic. 
So this is also, I didn't get this at Target. My boyfriend bought this for me for my birthday. I honestly have no idea where he got it for me. But like I just said, I love my Nintendo Switch. I play Animal Crossing and if you guys know Animal Crossing, you know this t-shirt. So it says KK Slider, nothing shredded, nothing gained. Love that t-shirt. Then the last, not the last one. This one I also got at Target. Um, this is Jurassic Park. Self-explanatory. It's Jurassic Park. <laughs> This is also one that I recently just got, and it is kind of a little too big, so I probably could put this one in the wash, as, or in the dryer as well. But I thought it was so cute. It says vacation mode, and it's all Mickey Mouse characters. Like, I thought it was really cute. I work with kids, so I thought that would be, like, a fun shirt to wear. Oh, also, with my Jurassic Park t-shirt, when I was at work one day, this little boy came up to me, and he goes, You have a dinosaur on your shirt! I was like, I do! It was just, like, the cutest thing in the entire world. So the last section of t-shirts that I'm going to talk about are my concert tees. So I, if you guys love graphic tees, I highly recommend every single time you go to a concert, you get a t-shirt. My mom has told me that ever since my first concert. So there has not been one concert I have gone to and not bought a t-shirt. I just... It's just like a tradition with me. I just love like my concert tees because every single time I wear that t-shirt, I remember that concert and I remember how amazing it was. There's only one t-shirt in here and it's this one right here that I didn't go to. My parents actually bought this for me because I wasn't able to go. But, so let's talk about that one. So this is the Lady Gaga Limited Jazz and Piano Engagement Las Vegas 2019. My parents were able to go to Las Vegas and see her. I was not because I was in school and they also didn't invite me. So that t-shirt is the only one I haven't been to, like the physical concert, but all these I have been. <laughs> so I love this t-shirt because I love Lady Gaga and my parents got it for me um, and they picked it out and I love that one. So the next one is a Khalid one. This is the Roxy Tour. So me and my friend Jordan, we both went to Khalid twice, I think. Was it twice? Yeah, we did see Khalid twice. I don't know why that, I don't know why I had to remember that. I saw her the first time and then saw him with her the third, second time. What am I saying? We've seen him twice. So I just like this tour. It was fun. Um, I like how all the concert tees have the dates on the back. Like, I just think it's a special touch. <laughs> And then this is Bruno Mars, the Moonshine Jungle Tour. This is one of my, not my very first tour, but one of my first tours. Um, this is Bruno Mars. I am obsessed with Bruno Mars so much. I love him to death. Me and my parents and my grandma, we saw them twice in one year at the exact same tour. And then me and my mom saw him again. So the Moonshine Jungle Tour, I went to two dates because he came in Denver and then at the end of the tour he like added it on and we wanted to go so this is the first one I think the second t-shirt I got says like um, something about like jungle or something it doesn't fit me anymore and I have it in my closet it's just I don't wear it that much so I didn't want to put it in this video so that's that this one I didn't buy at the concert um, it says dripping in finesse. It don't make no sense. Um, this one's awesome. I bought this, um, I think, through Bruno Mars merch, like website. That's also a really good place to get graphic tees, cause a lot of tees that artists put out are limited edition. So if you grab it, like you're good to go. Like no, like you have to grab it. Um, I also do have another Bruno Mars T-shirt from the second or the third tour we've been to but it is in the wash right now so I can't show you but it's white and it has his face on it that one's from the 24k magic tour this one I just bought I love this t-shirt so this is a Harry Styles t-shirt um, I didn't buy this on Harry Styles I bought it on like rudimentary embroidered uh, I'll put like their Etsy page on the screen she's amazing I love her design so much so this says treat people with kindness and it has the little rainbow. I think it's so cute. I absolutely love this t-shirt so much. It took like a month for it to come in because she has like a lot of people wanting to buy her designs. So like I got it, like they sell out fast. So I bought it. She has to obviously make the design and then she has to ship it out. And with COVID it took a little while. So it took a while to ship, but 
Um, that also is a really good place to buy um, t-shirts is look up your artist on like at CNC who makes like t-shirts from them because this girl like she has a bunch of lyrics on t-shirts and I definitely want to buy more but that helped. So this one I don't wear as much but I just wanted to put in there because it's just a really cool concert we went to. So ex ambassadors, me and our boyfriend went there. They were so good. It was just a really fun concert. So I don't wear this that much just because I just honestly don't. <laughs> I don't know why. I just have to go for the others more. Then um, this is a threading water t-shirt. I partnered up with threading water for let's say probably for like a year. Um, I'm not working with them anymore just because the ambassador program got a little too stressful for me. But I really do love their t-shirts. Like this is so cute. It's just really cute t-shirts. This is another threading water t-shirt. I like the design so much. So honestly like if you find companies that you like you can get their t-shirts. Um, I don't know why those two are in this section. These two are supposed to be in the graphic tee section, but I decided to put it in the artist band tee section. Um, so this is another Khalid t-shirt. This is from the first tour me and my friend went to. I love this t-shirt. I wore this t-shirt constantly for like months. So the, <laughs> the um, what is this? Writing <laughs> is totally faded. Um, but I love, this was such an awesome tour. I honestly think I liked the American Teen Tour more than the Roxy Tour. Also, it was at Red Rocks, and Red Rocks is just an amazing venue. Okay, we're coming down to the last few. So, this is a 5 Seconds of Summer tee. Um, it's just really cute. This tee has gotten some, like, use. Like, it has terrible, terrible pit stains. has makeup all over this, so I don't wear this as, as much anymore. Just because it has got its use out of it. But it's still really cute. Me and my boyfriend went to that concert. And then, oh, this is the last one. Besides the one I'm wearing. <laughs> so this is the Jonas Brothers t-shirt. We went to the Happiness Begins tour. When was that? Was it like January or something? I can't remember when it was. But this is their concert tee. I honestly like don't wear it that much because I honestly don't like it. I wanted a different t-shirt. But... I always buy the actual concert tee so where you can see the dates on the back. I never really go to a concert and just buy like a graphic tee from them. It has to have the actual tour dates on the back because it makes it more legit. So I wanted something different but I ended up going with that because that's just what I got. And I think it was a little bit cheaper. So we'll go through the one I'm wearing right now. This is the Ariana Grande Sweetener World Tour. Honestly, probably I would say the best tour I've been to. Yeah, the best, best concert. I love Ariana Grande so, so much. So, yes, those are my graphic tees. I have a bunch, and I also have a bunch that I didn't even show you guys, but a lot of them, if I didn't show you, like, I haven't worn in the past, like, six months, so I'm not going to show you guys. So, Yes, yeah, so those are some of my tips and tricks to get graphic tees where you can get them and that's just my graphic tee collection. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you liked. Subscribe down below if you enjoyed it. So also just go follow my Instagram. Might as well see what I'm up to. And yes, that is going to be it. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye. And it goes a little yeah. something like... Oh,